Yeah, we're starting the match here. Red team has center stage there. Very important. Oh, and the Sheik overextends there. Oh, uh, Captain Falcon not quite able to hold on to the ledge, keep the Sheik from coming back. Smart recovery. Yeah, quite lucky. Well, not lucky, sorry. Yeah. Very, very intelligent to be good to be alive there. The exit from Morris to try to get this back. Blue team Falcon trying. barely hanging on there. That up smash almost taking it, and the Red Fox saving his teammate. Oh, accidental teammate grab. It seems the blue team gives the impression that they're very much in control of this match. From oh, the little we've seen. I think uh, part of that's been the, the Sheik's managed to keep one of the uh, other members busy kind of off the ledge and uh, Blue Fox has managed to kind of rack up the damage. Ooh, nice fair there. Normally you see Sheik's go for Nair or uh, Bear. Uh, fair, fair being a tighter window. Absolutely. Very clutch to knock Fox straight out with his upbeat recovery. And there we see it again, Sheik successfully ledge guarding the red team. Oh, and the interception on the recovery. Was... Now Mortis' Sheik has yet to lose a stock. Oh, commentator's curse. And what I would, uh, hopefully like to see from the uh, from the red team a little more is I'm helping each other get back to the stage. Sheik so far has managed to successfully edge guard a good, at least three times, I think. And uh, and part of that, I think, is because the uh, the Blue Fox has been keeping the, his, uh, the, the red teammate busy. Oh yeah, absolutely. Doing a very good job of singling them out so that she can get good, calm edge guards. It's what we were talking about earlier, players knowing their roles. It's one of the fundamentals of teams. The blue team certainly seems to be holding their own. It seems to be pressing their fundamentals. Unfortunately, Leax didn't reach with that Firefox. And both these, both red team members cannot get touched properly. Any Sheik air, uh, proper hit from Sheik or, or smash attack from Fox will take the game now. Sorry, the stock. Looks like this is going to be it. Oh, oh, hanging on there. Saves Captain Falcon there. Oh, spoke too soon. Very dominant game. Very for dominant. The blue team. Malamortis sort of holding on to a solid three stocks. It looks like we're going to see a switch. Oh, to, uh, interesting. Ditto teams. We'll see how this plays out. Malmort is being very strong with the Sheik earlier. Now yeah. he switched to the Falcon. Uh, that, is, that is very interesting. Maybe to perhaps avoid a proper counter pick. Perhaps you know, you can't counter pick a Ditto team very well. And we're going to Dreamland. Game two. Though, this is surprising because Sheik's also really good on Dreamland, once again. Interesting how the counter pick. Honestly, they, were, they had such a league that uh, I, I wouldn't be surprised if they were just doing it because uh, Mal Morris felt like playing Falcon. Well, we'll certainly see how this plays out for them. So far, Blue Team seems to be doing very well. Ah, yeah, you're right. Two stocks up. Two kills there. E from the ledge. That hurt. Oh, unfortunate. Miss of the ledge. And the taunt from the red team. 
I have a taunt. Take what you can get. Oh my god. Oh. Let me get back. Oh. That's crazy offstage gameplay there. You don't see that too often, folks. Red team holding center stage there. Some type of good control. Oh, what a shame there. Let's hope they can hold it. Yeah, I was about to say that this game, this match wasn't actually that far off for a red team, but then before I spoke, uh, blue team went ahead and proved me wrong with that knee and uh, Fox not being able to make it back. Sometimes in situations like that, when uh, you, you are uh, pretty sure you won't make it back, I've, uh, I've heard some players uh, give their opinion that it's better to just side be back off so that you can help your teammate in time. Because it is deadly when there's a 2v1 with uh, characters, with, uh, players with as good coordination as these two. I'm not sure what that was about. Certainly not impossible. It's certainly difficult, but we've already seen him take two stocks. I think blue team wants to end this in style. But we've seen red team's what, gonna keep four trying. Four punches now. That's the five, and he manages to hit one. Oh, ah, he doesn't make it back. Well, good games for blue team. It was starting to look like perhaps the red team was going to clutch to that out. <laughs> I mean, when you throw six falcon punches in a row out and hit your teammate with a couple of them, you yeah. know, things, things can happen there. Unfortunately for red team, we didn't see that turnaround. And that's a 2-0 for Leax and Malmortis.